Hey guys, it's Mobile Man Dan here with Core Smartphone, bringing you an unboxing of the EE Osprey Mini 2. This device is brand new from EE, it's one of their new mobile Wi-Fi connection devices, gets you on the move with your laptop or your tablet. As you can see, it's a pretty simple box, very EE branded, yellow and, and the green EE logo all around. Uh, you get a picture on the front, um, EE logo on the sides. On the back you've got some key specs, so you can get up to 10 devices online at once. No need to find a Wi-Fi hotspot never again. Personalise your device with coloured bumpers, of which you do get some in the box, and information about their network. Pretty simple stuff. So, sliding it out of the pouch, and you get the standard square box, um, all yellow again, little security tab. Taking the lid off, you get the Keep Me card. Uh, now the Keep Me card is really important because this on the back has your mobile Wi-Fi network name and security key. So keep this safe to the side for a few minutes. You'll need it later on. So looking at the top, you get the device. Uh, I've gone for the black and the yellow one. Uh, it looks rather nice. Um, putting it to the side, so we'll go back to that again in a minute. You get the micro USB cable. Uh, yellow, very much again branded, you know this is an EE device, micro USB to USB cable used for charging. Uh, you get some uh, inserts which you can take out and there you have your other bumpers. So you have a pink and a turquoise colour green um, rubber bands that go around the outside which are show you in a couple of minutes. does make uh, it rather customizable and uh, looks pretty cool really. Um, this is quite a nice design. So as you can see the device looks uh, quite small, quite handy and you can take it with you and Eve included in the box um, a little pouch, uh, EE logo on the top in yellow with a little black pouch zip goes all the way around the outside and you can pop your device in there to keep it uh, clean and keep it safe perfect if you're travelling and on the move the device itself looks pretty cool. You get uh, five LEDs, a 4G, 3G and a text message notification light, plus the E logo with the power key on the front. Uh, right hand side has the micro USB port with the side and this other side here completely plain and the back has a single sticker which also has your Wi-Fi key. Uh, this is how you take the band off. Uh, really simple, it just kind of pops off um, and you can use one of the ones that come um, supplied in the box. Um, you also get access to the reset button, the little pinhole, and the micro SIM card slot. Um, we don't recommend you use an adapter. The best thing is get a micro SIM card that fits properly, just to make sure it doesn't uh, snap the pins off. So to put one of these connections on, um, all you do is you just kind of pop it over. Um, you make sure that the uh, micro USB port is in the right side, not like I've done in this video, um, and make sure the power button is still visible at the front. Uh, as you can see, it's now turned green. Um, so the power button has some LED lights, uh, which now shows it's switched on. It's green when it's powered, it's red when the battery's running low, and there's your LED lights which show you uh, your signal and what network you're connected to, plus also if you have any messages. Quite handy. So this has been a quick look at the EE Osprey Mini 2. Thanks for watching. Check out the full review coming shortly over at Cool Smartphone. Any questions, please leave comments below or over on the article.